night as a report of a chimney fire. He said neighbors had managed to pull one person from the home, but there was another person that was trapped inside. The chief says when they arrived, there were just flames shooting from both sides of the house. There was no way to go in and try and rescue that person. The fire would eventually go to three alarms, bringing in firefighters from 14 towns, 20 pieces of apparatus. The chief says the cold did cause some problems. They had numerous pieces of equipment that froze. As far as getting water to the scene, they had to pump that from a, a hydrant in Bristol. Uh, the chief says at this point, they don't know how this fire started. The state fire marshal's office is leading the investigation, and they said they do believe they have an idea of where this fire started. At this point, we're looking at the, the common area where these folks typically lived. Okay. And uh, by common area, was there a wood stove or something like that in that area? They did have wood stoves in the house. But again, the fire marshal's office has not determined if those wood stoves were in any way responsible for starting this fire. An autopsy is scheduled for later this morning, after which they should be able to release some more information. There are also two firefighters who suffered minor injuries. Reporting live in Danbury, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.